Here's how you write 8 25ths, the fraction 8 25ths as a decimal. So 8, that is smaller than 25. So when we divide 8 by 25 to get our decimal, it's going to be less than 1. It's going to be a decimal. So we're going to take 8, and we want to see how many times 25 goes into 8. So 25 doesn't go into 8. We could make it 80 if we put a 0 and a decimal point up here. Now 3 times 25, that's 75. So if we subtract here, we'll get 5. won't go into 5, but we could call it 50. Because now, 2 times 25, that's 50. Subtract, 0, no remainder. So in answer to our question, when we take the fraction 8 25ths, convert it to a decimal, we end up with 0 0.32. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.